All right, everybody, welcome back to another episode of Work with Cy Brownlow. I am your host, Cy Brownlow. Remember, no one is worthless, no story is worthless. Today, ladies and gentlemen, look, tax season, we all know has just passed, but, you know, for those who are still riding, uh, you know, edge here and there, teetering on, you know, man, do a man, am I gonna file the extension? Am I gonna, you know, just wait till next year or whatever? We have someone, you know, to answer all these wonderful questions. Joining us all the way, is it Houston, Texas? Yes, Houston, all Texas. Right. <laughs> H Town, y'all. Okay, yes, man. Yes, yes, yes. Y'all can put some on their name now. Okay, H Town. <laughs> all right, Houston. All right. But joining me all the way from Houston, please put your hands together for Miss Catherine Mitchell. Miss Cat. <laughs> thank you thank you <laughs> you are welcome man first of all man once again welcome to the platform i am glad to have you here um and man look we gonna talk some real important stuff you know what i'm saying okay all right let's talk look. <laughs> on now. all right so now you are the ceo of flat fee tax flat. prep yes flat. sir okay um now but not only that um you are preparing to launch a tax prep academy this fall which yes will, you know provide small businesses and you with knowledge about taxes can you just tell us a little bit more about the program and what all for, will cover for sure for sure so <clears throat> so basically we're in an age where you know we need multiple streams of income you know what i'm saying and so tax preparation is just one of those industries that a lot of people are intimidated with but once you get in, into it you'll realize it's not as you know extensive it's not as hard uh as you know one would think so with that said it's a great uh you know side gig side hustle or you know something you know people literally might step away from the nine to five and and do it full time so what the academy will does teach not only teaches you tax prep you know of course you want to learn the business right but we also uh teach everyone the foundation of their business so setting up their llc getting their business bank account you know all that good stuff so we help them do the foundation of the business we teach them how to do tax preparation um, and then on top of that, we help them get all the credentials that they'll need in order to be uh, basically official with the IRS. So that way they're doing everything legally and legitimately, um, you know, with the IRS. And the great thing about the program is that it's it's a hands on, uh, you know, step by step program. It's 100 percent online. So you take it at your own pace. Um, and with that said, because I know y'all way out there and we're here, anybody can join. So this is not a Houston thing. Um, you know, anybody um, under the sound of my voice can join the Academy. And, uh, the you know, we walk you through step by step. And then once we wrap up, guess what? We're right into the tax season. So the great thing is, is that we end into the money. So you get to get the skill and then use it immediately. So it's not gonna be like no long, you know, one year, two years before you start, you know, reaping the rewards of the knowledge that you've gained. It's like literally six months and boom, you know, you're you're off to the races. Mm, okay, first of all, let me just say that is, A, that is very impressive and B, you know, um, that meets a, you know, need. You know, because as you said, hey, I'm going through this process. I'm learning these skills. Yes, it's six months, but you're telling me as soon as we're done with this, we're going right into tax season and I could just come out and I can really start making my money. And exactly. I oh. Exactly. Exactly. That, so th I think to me, like, you know, if I could compare it to anything else, you know, out there, I just think that benefit alone is just getting out and going straight to the money. Like, you know, for me, I'm like, okay, sign, you know, if it was me, I'd be like, sign me up, you know? <laughs> because of course, you know, you invest your time, your money into something, you know, you want to get a return on that investment as quickly as you can. So, you know, that's why we, we want to make sure that you get all you need 
So we give you that time. But again, once you get out of, out of the academy, boom, we want you, you know, right in, in the swing of things. Oh, yeah, working. Come on now. All right. Look, yes, yes. I mean, well, <laughs> well, okay. So real quick, around here, we talk about return on investment. And sometimes we talk about college. Yeah. And then I'm going to be real. Sometimes college is not a man. Sometimes a lot of people don't get their return on investment when it comes to an education because you're sort of like put into something that you really have no control over. But something such as this, where you can literally see, hey, you know what? No, I can see in six months, man, yep. it's going to be this. People are going to need that. Oh man, I have the skills. I've learned this that, and the other. Oh man, I can go out here and do this right now. You and, know? Yep. And and the great thing about tax prep, guys, that that a lot of people have to understand, this ain't a luxury business. Every like, no matter what's going on in the economy, the, the pandemic, it don't matter. People have to file their taxes. That's one thing you want. I mean, let's be real. And so with that being said, there's never going to be a time where the industry that I'm in is not going to be uh, uh, needed because of the fact that Uncle Sam, he greedy and he going to always want his coins. Right. <laughs> so that's good for me. <laughs> so, hey, as long as he stays greedy, I'm going to stay <laughs> in business. Right. Okay. okay. All right. Hey, look, I mean, but that's real. That's real. <laughs> We have to pay taxes. You, you, we you have know, to. Man, regardless of anything else is going on, man, their, their taxes have to be paid. Whether you're a business, whether you know you're a small business, whether you're yep. just out here paying your own taxes, you yep. know, what I'm saying? you got to pay those taxes. All right. So let me just ask real quick. You know, for those who may be curious of your background and taxes, okay. accounting, and things, or economics, or what have you, mm -hmm. can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah. So. Um, Basically, I started off actually just a few short years ago. Um, so that, like I said, the thing about tax prep that people, I won't say get confused, but again, it's just a little misconception that they think that you have to be a mathematician. They think that you have to be an accountant and stuff like that. With basic tax prep, to be honest with you, it's, it's more data entry than anything. People are going to bring you their tax forms. You put it in the software and the software does most of the work for you. I'm going to just keep it real right now. There are some principles and some things that you need to know, you know, to 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 make sure that you're, you know, um, doing everything in, in accordingly. But again, it's not as aggressive as most would think. Now, you could be a basic tax preparer or you can advance yourself up and say, you know what, I'm going to become an accountant or you know what, I'm going to do X, Y, Z. But guess what? I'm a tax preparer. I prepare taxes, but I still have an accountant. I still have a bookkeeper. You get what I'm saying? So just like with being a doctor, you may have a heart doctor, a foot doctor, a you know, uh, all different type of, you know, doctorate It's the same thing with tax preparers and there's different levels to it as well. So with that being said, just the long story short, um, I started like maybe about five years ago um, with the company as just a regular agent. And then one of my friends, my colleagues that was in that company, she decided to branch off and start her own tax business. And she said, hey girl, can you come with me and help me, you know, open up my, my office? And with me branching off with her, that really was a life changer for me because I got to see hands-on, not just the tax side, but just the, you know, customer service side, the agent side, you know, just every aspect. And so, you know, after that year with her, I was like, hey girl, this is, I, I seen what your first, you know, your first, I, I ain't counting your coins, but I know that you made six figures, you know, in that first batch. Not not for the year, I'm talking about for her first check drop was a six figure check drop. I said, it, it's just too much money, boo. I'm gonna have to go off, <laughs> you know, and do my own thing, no hard feelings. So, and so 
you know, years ago, that's when we, you know, I started Flat Fee and the rest is history. So is it any formal college degree? No, it's just knowledge that I've acquired and gained. And then of course, training, you know, I do uh, get uh, updates and training for, through the IRS and stuff like that. But again, it's very minimal credentials that you would need because most of the things that we do is just data entry to be, you know, to be honest. Mm, okay. Now, you know, we're going to talk a little bit about some okay. programs in a yes. minute. In yes, a minute. yes, 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 okay. yes, yes. All right. Okay. All right. You know, I mean. <laughs> hey, we. I'm here. So let's talk about it. <laughs> okay. But, okay. But, you know, so let's just talk about, like, importance of tax knowledge, you know, because it doesn't matter. Big business, small yeah. business. You know, it doesn't matter if you're just trying to prepare taxes on your own. Why is proper tax knowledge a necessity? Proper tax knowledge is a necessity because this is your livelihood. This is your bread. This is your your money. So, I mean, and I, and I think, you know, that's why tax preparation, you know, has such a bad, you know, tax preparers have such a bad rep because of the fact that a lot of people know that they don't have no earthly clue about what's going on with their ta taxes. I'm just keeping it real. And that's how people get robbed. 2,000, 3,000, $4,000 taken out of their tax return because they don't know. And I, and I think just for, just for that alone, just so even if I'm gonna get somebody else to file my taxes, at least I know what they're doing so that way I know they're not they're not taking advantage of me and you know robbing me of my hard earned you know money that's due back to me. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? So I think the importance is just having an understanding of the process so that way you don't get taken advantage of. Okay. Okay. Well, no, and you know, that's key because you have to understand the process. Because as you said, man. Two thousand, three thousand, four thousand dollars, you know. Yeah. Even more, you know. Yes. And, and I mean, we are just talking about maybe like on a personal, you know, level, on a like company level, we're talking tens of thousands, if not like hundreds of thousands of dollars. Yes, I mean, so you know, basically, um, like this last tax season, um, you know, people were seeing, I'm talking about regular average you know, W-2 people were seeing upwards of fifteen, twenty thousand dollar $20,000, you know, refund checks. But if you don't know what a person doing on your tax return, they might say, oh, well, she don't know. So I'm gonna take 10,000 out of this. And then you, you know, you tell the customer, okay, well, you're getting back $10,000 and they, they don't know. So they like, okay, I'm cool. Thank you. You done bless my heart and don't even know that they just took you for $10,000. I'm just keeping it real. So that's why I said just, you know, not not necessarily that you have to do this because you want to make money or, you know, whatever the case may be, but just learning just the basics of taxation, I think is key. Just again, so you don't get, you know, got and taken advantage of. Yeah, yeah. I mean, because man, and we're about to get into it, you know. Yes. Sometimes we always, you know, don't do things accordingly, you know, to how they may need to be done or there may be some things we don't understand. So, and I mean, let's just keep it real. Sometimes in the hood, man, look here, how much money can I get back? I can get this much back, man, look yep. here, yeah. put this person on, put yep. that person on, I own this, that, and the other. Man, yep. PPP fraud loan, <laughs> can't even get into all that. But I mean, but, but it's real. That's just, that. that is real. That is real. That's, that's the reality. Yep. <laughs> so yes, people, yes. <laughs> These are reasons why proper tax knowledge is a necessity, okay? Most definitely. So now, Let's just get into this question here. Now, let's talk <laughs> about these programs out here, you know, that once again, we do things out of necessity. Sometimes, yeah. you know, man, we may not want to go, you know, up the street to a h and &R block or this tax service or that tax service. We may not want to trust the mom and pop, you know, shop tax service, even though they stuff may be legit. We just... Yeah. Man. Yep. You, yep. 
we are very speculative as people, especially the African American community because of. Yeah, no, I, I, I totally get it. Okay. I totally get it. Yep. We have programs out here like a turbo tax. I don't want to yeah. touch y'all out like they ain't give y'all. <laughs> <laughs> but we have programs out here like those and other programs, you know, which I guess at times can be good depending on what it is that you're doing. But why is it better to, you know, have a professional prepare your taxes instead of like... That's a, that's a great question. So, first of all, you know, not to down talk, you know, Turbo or anything like that, you know, cool platform, whatever the case may be. I just want to preface this though. A lot of people get on TurboTax because they hear the word free. Oh, it's free, so I'm gonna just do it. And so you come to somebody like me and I say, okay, well, my fee is $3.99 or you know, $4.99. And you'd be like, well, <laughs> I'm not going to Miss Cat because Miss Cat fee is XYZ. But guess what? You go to TurboTax and TurboTax, the computer gets you $2,000 back but you spend $3.99 or $4.99 with Miss Cat, and Miss Cat gets you $10,000 back, right? So it's just like, would you rather pay a fee to insure? You know, because again, you have to understand with services like TurboTax, you have to hope that the computer is generating your stuff correctly. You don't, you don't, and because you don't know. You don't have no earthly clue what you're looking for, what you should be trying to do. You just put your W-2 in there and hope to God that you get a, a two fig, two digits that pop up. You're look, looking for that hot, that closest number that you can get to that 10,000. And, and as long as I can get my number up to here, I'm good to go. And you never know, you might, you might have totally did yourself a total dis justice because you didn't want to actually just pay a fee for somebody that know exactly what to do with your tax situation. Okay, you a small business, you got this, da, da, da. okay, let me, I already know, boom, 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 I already know what forms you need, I already know exactly what to do for your tax situation, I'll make sure that you get every single thing that you, you know, deserve. Um, and then also, to my understanding, now I don't use that software, you know, those type of software, so I can only go based on what I heard, but some of the functionalities are limited, you know, so they don't have some of the forms, they don't have some of the access. Like, for example, this year, we had a lot of COVID relief um, stuff that was available, but guess what? I, I, I can't vouch for that, but I know in my software, my professional, you know, tax software, I have COVID relief things that, you know, a lot of people suffer from, but you wouldn't, would you know that as a regular person, you don't even know what forms, you don't even know what to look for, but last but not least. So you submit your stuff to TurboTax and for whatever reason, you never get your refund or, you know, they, they, you know, you get a portion of your refund or something happens. Is, is there a person you could pick up at, the phone at TurboTax and say, hey, my refund or blah, blah, blah. Nah, right? You just kind of <laughs> on your own, right? Mm -hmm. So that's my my take on those type of things. It's just like, hey, I've been doing, like with some of my clients, some of them I've never met a day in my life. I service clients nationwide because I have a 100% virtual setup, right? So some of my clients, they trust me with everything for years. And if something happened with them, I'm on the line. I'm, you know, hey, let's let's do this. Here's a number to call. Let's da da da. Oh, you need an amendment. This that, and the third, right? So at the end of the day, I think that personalization as well, you know, is is key. Somebody that you know that got your back. That's you know, year after year. Okay, Miss Cat, I'm ready. Let me just send you know. Let me send you these W twos, and we you know, very smooth process. So. Not to be long-winded, but that's just my take, you know. But I will say this, though. Come if on. you just have, like, one W-2, you know what I'm saying, or, or something so simplistic, it's like, okay, you might not want to pay $399, 499 to file one, you know, one W-2. You, you get what I'm saying? But uh, I, I, to be honest with you, I might still consult because you just never know you know what you might miss out oh you a teacher oh you this that and okay do, do you need to itemize right i'm a high income i might need to itemize what can i itemize right 
most of the time those softwares they just you just plug and play and hope that you do right but you can't ask them no questions what if you have questions during the process who you want to ask C call ghostbusters who gonna help you ty who gonna help you i'm at <laughs> So that's that's just my standpoint. You gotta you gotta you gotta think about that. So that's my little rant for today. You got me ranting today. <laughs> <laughs> look, look, hey, look. Let me just say right now. All right, she just went to church on y'all. All right, y'all just got that gospel dropped on y'all real quick. All right, man. Look, if you don't know now, you now know. you know. Look. <laughs> but okay, you bring up man imperative points okay like very important points man if i have questions i can't ask this form there may be certain documents you know that i may need that i don't know that i may need and now i'm getting all these extra forms back at the end yeah. of the year or you know six months from now hey you know what we need this from you we need that from yeah. you. oh well man i've been audited you know well man i've been audited why you know hey. i've been doing you know so to save yourself the trouble of all that, yes, man. Please see a professional. <laughs> all right, that, I mean, that's just all I'm asking. Please see it's a it's, it, And I would just say that, especially if you don't even know nothing about nothing, like if you don't know what a deduction is, if you don't know what a credit is, mm -hmm. like if you just, if you don't even have the basic common knowledge of taxes, go see somebody. Cause most likely you ain't doing it right. I don't care how simple and oh, I just click this and click. You're not doing it right. I, I, that's just my opinion. You need to make sure, you know, pay that extra fee. It's okay. You know, <laughs> pay that extra fee and just make sure that you, you know, getting your stuff done correctly. Okay. All right. Hey y'all hey, go ahead now. <laughs> I mean, just because it says free, it, hey. it's going to be free. All hey. right. But it, it, it's definitely not free if it's costing you thousands of dollars on the back end. <laughs> there you go. All right. <laughs> I mean, look here. Come on now. All right. Some of us with them PPP loans. Okay. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not playing with you tonight. But <laughs> on with y'all. All right. <laughs> okay. Anyway, moving along. Okay. Well, let's talk about. Um, you know. Basically, you know, is tax preparation a nice side job or a nice side hustle? if you're not really ready for a career in it? Well, <clears throat> let me let me just answer it in this way, and maybe th this might. Um, okay. So tax prep is a billion-dollar industry. Not a million, not a thousandaire. This is a billion-dollar industry, okay? Um, if you attack tax prep aggressively, like if you say, you know what? For the next four months, I'm going to, you know, shut everything down um, and I'm going to focus 100 percent on doing taxes. You could literally make enough money um, to sustain you for the rest of the year. So a lot of tax professionals pull in six, seven figures in four months. OK, mm -hmm. um, so with that said, if you if you, you know, do it on the side, you know, it's unlimited earning potential. So it's kind of, you know, what you put into it is what you get out of it, if that makes sense. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So with that said, I definitely would suggest that anybody who, you know, is interested in making some side money or, like I said, walking off their job or, you know, just, I would say, getting a lump sum of money at the beginning of the year because, of course, tax prep kind of starts off the year. So even if I made an extra 30,000, 40,000, you know, starting off the year, a lot of people don't even make that in a whole year combined with their job, right? So, um, and that, and let me just preface, that's like a part-time half side, <laughs> side hustle um, income, 30, 40,000. So with that say, yes, I advocate and I definitely do, you know, suggest that, you know, that people get into it because again, it's not much credentials that you need. It's not much, you know, math. It's not as intense as you would think it would be. So it, it wouldn't hurt for, you know, individuals to to be, you know, get into it. That's my opinion. Okay. Well, look, no, hey, first and <laughs> foremost, let me just say, I, my ears just went up. You know, <laughs> and like, Hmm, a billion dollar industry? Yes. So that's so that means that's opportunity for somebody, everybody to really get into it. 
Exactly. And, exactly. You know, pretty much as you said, if you just really if you're really about your business and just put your, you know, mind to it and hit the grind, you can really make the money you need to make for the year and still go and enjoy and do other things that you may want to do as well. Exactly. Yeah. And the cool thing about it is we give you the blueprint <laughs> so you don't have to you don't have to guess. You don't have to think, am I doing the right thing? Am I? We walk you through step by step. So it ain't no excuse. <laughs> the only excuse you have if you don't apply yourself or apply the knowledge, you know, that we provide. Other than that, you you know, we make sure that you're good to go. Tax Prep Academy, y'all. <laughs> yep, 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 it's coming, y'all. Look. So look, so now if people want to get in contact with you, they want to know more, they want to follow okay. you on social media, how can they do so? Yes. So uh, the company is Flat Fee Tax Prep and Services. So you can find us at Flat Fee Tax Prep and Services on Facebook, at Flat Fee uh, Tax Prep on Instagram. But for the Tax Academy, guys, we do have a website flatfeetaxacademy.com. Very simple. F L A T F E E taxacademy.com. All the um, information is there. So if you guys want to get more information, definitely visit the website and we can, you know, definitely get you started. All right. Now we don't, we're not going to officially launch in, uh, until August, but uh, once we, once we, so basically what we're doing is we're getting the students now because in August you can't jump like you're, we launch in August. So those that are in, those are the people that launch. And if you miss it, you're going to have to catch it next season. So we're basically, you know, getting people signed up now. So that way, August, we're off to the races. There it is, y'all. Okay, come on now. All right. <laughs> um, we heard it here first. I don't All know right. what they waiting for. Look. <laughs> okay. Uh, so now, look, I've come to the last question. Question my show is known for. I would love to get your answer. Miss okay. Catherine Mitchell. Miss Cat, y'all. Okay. <laughs> you know Miss Cat. All right. <laughs> Miss Cat. What is the one word that best describes you and why? Whew. Uh, <laughs> I, I, you know what? I wasn't supposed to be caught off guard with this, but look, I, I got so chatty. Um, I would say the one word that best describes me. Um, uh, I would say, I would say sassy, <laughs> maybe sassy. Okay, cool. um, I, I know that could kind of go either way, but I would say sassy because I do, you know, have my little, you know, <laughs> snap to me, you know what I'm saying? Um, but I'm just me, you know, either it's like to know me is to love me for sure. But, uh, I would just say, you know, sassy, um, in a good way. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. No, well, look, you know, let me just say real quick, you know, like, I think it's dope. Yes, sass, pizzazz, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Energy. Charismatic, look. Charismatic. Charismatic. <laughs> no, I mean, but yes, sitting here talking to you, just the energy exchange between us, you know what I'm saying? And I know if you're, as I said before, I went on to your site, I've seen you know, people giving their testimonials, you know, about going through the program and just the, some of the things they had to say. And, you know, you are a resource, you know, and yes, if my charm or charisma, <laughs> if my sass, you know, brings these people into me and it's all family, it's all love, either you're going to love it or you're going to hate it. If you hate yeah. it, okay, cool. This may <laughs> not just be for you. All right, you can go on about yeah. your business, but you love it. Come on over here. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> All right. Look, no. But, man, look. Hey. So, once again, that website for the uh, Tax Academy is flatfeetaxacademy.com. That is correct. Flatfeetaxacademy.com. All right, you, man. You look heard it here y'all. first. Man. <laughs> All right. And um and yeah, the testimonials. So if you if you guys want to hear from other people, you know, uh, about their experience, we have plenty of testimonials. You can Google flat fee tax prepping services. Um, and there's more testimonials on our Google page as well. But definitely, guys, um, I, I would say don't speculate. Don't you know, don't wait. 
just go ahead and do something that's going to help you, you know, change your life. And again, even if it's just a matter of, you know, doing this on the side and, you know, making an extra couple thousand to start your year off, you deserve it. You're worth it. And let's, let's get to it. All right. All right, y'all. Look, there it is, man. All right. <laughs> Look here, people, y'all know I'm about the informative content. There it is, okay? <laughs> and on that note, ladies and gentlemen, man, this has been World with Ty Brownlow. I've been your host, Ty Brownlow. Remember, no one is worthless, no story is worthless. You can follow me, all social media platforms, World with Ty Brownlow, or you can just go to my website, tybrownlow.com. Get this wonderful conversation, plus other great conversations as well. Miss Cat. <laughs> Thank you for having me. All right, no problem. Without <laughs> y'all. Peace.